Welcome everybody, Crimson Dragon here, playing some, uh, Station Years. Um, this has supposedly been out since 2017, but, uh, I thought I'd give it a, a try here, and why not, it's like pretty fun, something different, and, uh, never saw anybody play this. Um, but, uh, it's supposed to be a survival type game, building a space station, and, uh, yeah, so let's, uh, do this tutorials, and, uh, yeah, see what it's like. Yeah, it's probably going to be us right there. All identified. Alright. Uh, practical training, stage one, basic skills. Welcome to the Lunar Training Base, Cadet. The ODA has approved your application, so let's improve your chances of survival. Um, chances of surviving deployment to the solar system. Enter the training base through the airlock ahead. Okay. Woo. Excuse me. Uh, working and building under hazardous conditions far from home, a stationer needs many special special skills. Uh, you can also uh, you also need to push buttons. Uh, press cycle to interior to enter the base. Seriously, come on. Oh, got forever. Thank you. Alright, uh before the original Space Engineers handbook colla um handbook collapsed into the singularity, it established a central stationers protocol. Cadets have two hands but should only do one thing at a time. Yeah, we hurt ourselves if we do it. Otherwise, uh, press uh, mouse button, interact, E swaps hand. Uh, you could have, uh, you could have been a juggler, uh, but you signed up as a stationer. Uh, since you're going to juggle tools instead, um, so oh, so you're going to juggle tools? On, yeah, um, lots of them. Uh, some must be activated first with right mouse. Okay, so to the power torch. All right, uh, so far your hands are working fine. That's good. Well, I hope so. Uh, you'll need them. Uh, so let's try dropping and throwing. Uh, press Q to drop items or hold Q to throw them. Okay. Uh, sometimes you need to put items down more carefully. Uh, their ODA property. Try to use T and check your suit joints. Um, and check your suit joints are working smoothly. What the heck? Okay, well, let's pick this up. We need to pick this up so we got one more here. Uh, T and there and uh, that didn't work right. Okay, anyways. Um, I wanted it more on the table, but whatever. It is what it is now. Uh, we can't teach you everything, but you, but we can ensure you've got the basics down. Surviving in the solar system is up to you. Uh, hold left alt to access your inventory, then click on a panel to open it. Uh, 
As a station here, uh, there's never just one way to achieve the goal. How you solve a problem is up to you. That goes for your suit too. Try opening your inventory with numeric keys. Uh, knowing where something is is how you is how to get it quick. Uh, makes. Uh, all the difference. Inventory management saves lives. Start by dragging items into your hand from your inventory. That's not good. Uh, as a stationer, you'll be picking things up a lot. The solar system's a mess. There's just that's just how it is. Try dropping items, dragging items from the world directly into your inventory. Drag my belt from ground to backpack. I assume this is the backpack. Oh. Uh, okay. I did it kind of backwards, but anyways. Uh, until Sura Biomedia breeds a four-armed stationer, uh, you're stuck with two hands. But there's quick ways to move items into them. Uh, use mouse wheel to select an item in an open UI window, then press F to equip it. Uh, move road flare to from bad pad to left hand. Activate road flare using secondary action. Oh, uh, stationary uh, equipment is designed for durability and ease of fabrication, uh, not good looks. Um, many of them, like power tools, contain items like batteries or gas canisters. Open the flare with your right hand, open mining belt.
I don't know what the heck I'm doing right now. <laughs> uh, uh, drop flare. Okay, we got we got. Jeez, uh, I'm crow. Interesting. Uh, open mining belt. Left alt. Open mine belt. I did. Oh, mine belt. It's open. I think I'm doing this backwards or something like that, but this is what's going to happen. going on here I'm doing it open mining belt I did mining belt is open what is your malfunction <sighs> left alt left and drag interact with inventory This is oh, 
I did open up the mining bell, you numb nut. Okay, station has equipment. Yes, no, maybe. I don't understand. What am I missing? What is so st open mining belt? It's open. This is ridiculous. What am I missing? Let's try this again. Let us try this again. I don't know if it was me. Did it freeze? What happened?
Okay, we've gone through all of this. Open your backpack. Try to do this one step at a time this time. Maybe we can get this right. Okay, so far so good. So far so good. There we go. All right. Jeez, I don't know what the heck happened. Everything just got all crushed or met. Yeah. All right. Um. All right. They call it space. Uh, don't be. Uh, but don't be fooled. There's never enough room. Uh, luckily, many items can be merged into stacks. Okay. Uh, if your HUD gets a little busy, you can shut inventory windows by clicking the X or pressing uh, yeah that uh apostrophe key or whatever uh to close all windows bam all right uh the oda assessment panel are satisfied uh you're not an immediate threat to yourself good work cadet Move to the next area of the training base for part two. Reviewing the basics of building. Uh-oh, we're in trouble. This is where we get in trouble. Oh, we're going outside. Uh-oh. Yeah, we're definitely in trouble. Uh, in this phase of testing, you'll either master basic building skills or run out of air. The construction area is too high to reach, so let's test your jetpack. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Alright, J toggle jetpack power, space ascent, left control descent. All right, uh, it's simple to build and easy to pressurize. Um, iron frames are the foundation of your 
stationary structure. Uh, pick up frames, right click to enter build mode, uh, build mode, um, then left click to place. Uh-huh. if you read. Um, most uh, stationary constructions have several stages, complete the frames, and make uh, them airtight by welding iron sheets onto them. Uh, you'll need a welder in your active hand, iron sheets in the other. Okay, so well, let's get down. Welder in this hand, uh, iron sheets into this hand. Sure, okay. Finish frame the iron sheets well That didn't work right. Dang it. There we go. Oh, come on. Come on, Dragon. What's going on with you? Left mouse interact. Right mouse toggle on. E swap hands. Hold left mouse construction. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, we did something. Uh, the base is now airtight, so you can add atmosphere. Activate the power, the area power controller to turn on the active vents and start airflow into the room. Monitor the external pressure on your status panel. Unlock helmet, open helmet. I don't know if I want to do that. Jeez, I'm crow, seriously. Oh. All right, we're not dying. All right, cadet. You've nearly finished phase one of Structioneers. Stationeers, practical testing. If you want to learn more, construct this stationpedia by pressing F1. Uh, once you've Red up close the red up 
grows the stationpedia. Uh, you'll be doing more testing soon, but for now, make yourself at home. Take off your suit and place it in a storage locker. Go to here, go to here, go to here, go to personal. Close the station A portal. Drag space helmet into the storage. Drag suit. Drag backpack. All that training has made you thirsty. You need a drink of water to rehydrate. Like we, uh, you have some in your back pocket. Oh, wow, okay. Uh, get a drink of water from uniform slot. Excellent, cadet. That's the last step of phase one. The ODA will be relieved if you survive this far. Uh, phase, uh, press the blue button. Complete button. Uh, to transmit your results to stationary command. I don't know if I want them to know. I don't want don't think I want them to know that I'm done. Congratulations. Your results have been received by Stationer Command of the Off World Development Agency. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's learn more about construction and everything. So that way we don't totally die while we're out there. Because, I mean, we all know that would really suck. Uh, practical training stage two construction. Hello, cadet. Uh, you've demonstrated essential stationary skills. Now it's time to put them to work. Stationers are builders above all else. Let's test your basic construction abilities. Oh, oh crow. Oh, jeez, I'm crow. Uh, without tools, a stationer is defenseless against a hostile environment. Universe. Sorry. Uh, go to the crate and pick up your tools before something terrible happens. Yeah, uh, cool. I'm afraid to know. Uh, could I have a screwdriver? Uh, place into a belt. Uh, drill. And then. There we go. The, in this uh, ODA training simulation, the walls were damaged. Uh, by a meteor shower. To replace them, you must first remove the damaged frames using the angled grinder. Okay, fair enough. Well, that was smooth. Uh, make sure this uh, base is tidy for the next cadet. Uh, finish constructing the base walls start with iron frames. Uh, complete frames with iron sheets and welder in an active hand. Okay, so we'll do this, do this. That's not what I wanted to do. 
That's what I wanted to do. We're doing something here. Look at progress. Uh, precision and planning are essential stationary skills. Uh, the last cadet was ejected from the program for building the auto lathe in the wrong place. They construct it piece by piece, then rebuild it in the correct position. <sighs> Seriously. Seriously. Uh, deconstruct stage five of oral lace. I don't even know where stage five is, you nummy. What's going on here? He's a crow, seriously. Dang it. I keep going back and forth. <laughs> oh, Jesus and Crow. This is. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Take that back. All right, you've got everything you need to rebuild the auto lathe in the correct um, highlighted position. So you should do that now uh, okay sure gotcha roger that copy I don't know what I'm grabbing all I know is we got a machine here that's doing the jig 
Okay. Uh, there we go. Whoa, holy crap. Stuff flying around anywhere now. Okay. Uh, crowbar required for deconstruction. I don't care about deconstruction. Uh, place an holiday kit. Uh, police, once police use wire welding torch and iron sheets for upgrade. sheets cable coils Plastic sheets. Screwdriver, okay. All right, I don't even think I used all the pieces and everything, like typically usually always happens um, without power you cannot fabricate much uh, to power up the station you need to reconnect the solar panels to the network start by removing the damaged cables interesting I moved damage cable in the bulb one. Uh, wire cutters. Oh, where am I going? No! <laughs> Alright, I got the... the wire cutters. Remove damaged cable one with wire cutters. Like I know where number one is. How is it I'm on the tool?
Alright, uh, Design and Power Networks is a central part of base construction. Construct it, connect the solar panels to the power network using cables from the crate. Uh, like many kits, cables come, offer several options to uh, to scroll through. Oh, no, that's awesome. Where's the door? There it is. All right, we need a uh, cable. We need that too. We need cable though. You're gonna face in the right way too. Interesting. Gonna rotate the stuff. Hello. Go into the box. Go into the box. Go into the box. Fine. There. You are there. I need. I need. This. this Place missing heavy junction. Okay. Do we still need this? Right mouse. Okay, um, undo this. Go back to this. Go to this. There we go. Ah, okay. Um, area of power construction uh, connectors separate out. Power and data with sub networks. Uh, stabilize your electrical flow and provide backup power. Uh, just be careful which way round you install them. Uh, okay, sure. <laughs> that goes there. I think we need this. And then we do this, and then we do something.
See, it's right, but it's wrong. It's right, but it's wrong. I don't understand. Do I got the wrong one? Oh, you dummy, jeez. So I was just rotating, I wasn't... Oh, man. Yeah. The ABC also charges batteries, uh, which is good. The ODA recommends keeping several charged batteries to hand at all time. Go Google Translate. Uh, in an outage, the battery will provide backup power briefly, too. Sweet. So, we use a crowbar to open this thing up. And then we get the uh, battery. Insert battery. Arrive for information. More information can be found in the stationpedia. Press F1 to refresh your knowledge of the APC uh, by consulting the entry of the stationpedia. Open stationpedia. Open power APC, 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 APC. ABC, ABC, where are you? Where are you, ABC? I don't see ABC. There we go. Jeez. Uh, well done. You have completed the power network. Uh, yeah, you did better than the last cadet. Turn on the APC to activate the network and let there be light. Yay. We got light. Yay. Good work, cadet. You've repaired the walls and finished the power system. Uh, that's the last step of phase two. Uh, press the complete button to transmit your results to stationary command and we'll move on. 
Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. There's still a lot of stuff around here to do. What's that? Congratulations! Your results have been received by Stationary Command of the Off World Development Agency. Joy, joy, joy. Mining and fabrication next. Oh, this should be fun. Uh. Okay. Let me know. Uh, practical training stage three mining and fabrication. Uh, welcome, cadet. As a stationer developed. Uh, deployed far from Earth, you have a choice. Forge your own resources from local materials or perish. Basic knowledge of mining and fabrication is essential. Repair the lunar ba test base to prove your skills. Oh crap, we are so much in trouble. Uh, design often works backwards. Uh, to repair the testing base, you need components for which you need a hydraulic pipe bender, which you need resources to fabricate. So, let's track down some ore using your tablet. Okay, I'm actually, I just noticed this, and I'm terribly sorry for that. Um... I am going to take this and I'm going to move it up here. There. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so you're seeing the whole screen. Nothing but the screen. So, hope you people. And uh, there we go. Okay, back to this. All right. Uh, get tablet from crate. Okay. Tablet, tablet, tablet. tablet. No tablet. All right. Zigo Tabby Tabby Tablet. Uh, Pad Eye. Jeez, I'm crow, man. Learn to read. Um, performs a range of different functions. With the tracking cartridge inserted, it helps you navigate to local beacons. Awesome, awesome, okay. I tracking tracker cartridge from crate to tablet. Turn on. Okay, that's turning it on. Okay, okay, okay. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Me smart. 
Uh, fighting or to build your base takes time. To help, we place the beacon at a nearby ore deposit. Use the tablet to navigate to the beacon, then get mining. Okay. Oops. All right, your mining belt does two things. It holds your mining tools and stores your ore, uh, the ore you mine. Uh, when it's equipped in your belt slot, uh, any ores mined are stored ar there automatically. The tricone rotary topo mining drill lives in your mining belt, functioning equally well in vacuum and atmosphere. It's uh, cemented. It's cemented carbide bits uh, increase resilience, bearing knife, and reduce uh, spalling. Uh, treat it well. Okay. Okay. Oops. Your mining belt should now have plenty of ore, um, iron ore in it. Carry it back to base and this gets smelting. <laughs> Oops. Anyways, uh, before it could be used for construction, raw ore uh, has to be turned into pure ingots. For that, the simplest solution is an arc furnace. Grab a kit from the crate and place it in the highlighted area. Get an arc furnace kit from what? that uh, connect our furnace to power using cables from tool belt
All right, we did something. The arc furnace won't operate at high enough temperatures to uh won't operate at high enough temperatures to create complex alloys, but it smells iron just fine. Add your iron ore to the front arc furnace. Okay, okay, I will, I will. Hold on, let me get out of here. Here's some crow. Do that, do that, do this, do that. Turn on. Activate. Ah, uh, that's it. You're done for now. So, swap back to the tool belt. You'll be needing it shortly. Okay, okay. You and Crow, give me a second here. Uh, simple, fast, and very efficient. An arc furnace also creates gas byproducts that could be filtered out and used for other purposes. Right now, however, you just need the ingots it makes. It's nearly finished. Oh. Yeah. Uh. Um. No. Six. Six. That there. That goes there. It goes into the side. Yeah. All right, the hydraulic pipe bender makes pipes as well as atmospheric devices and some portable structures. Uh, to build one of the, uh, with the oil lathe, you need iron, copper, and gold. The other ingots are, uh, you need are in the crate. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, the old lathe is multi-axis modular compositional tool. It fabricates a range of structural and device kits, including the humble hydraulic pipe bender. Click the, uh, the search button on the front to search to, uh, to search to select recipes. Do 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 where is the thing hydraulic pipe bender right uh print hydraulic pipe bender Oh okay pick up and place Okay. Uh, there we go. All right, things take time. Like the auto lathe, the hydraulic pipe bender has several construction stages. Follow the tool tips to finish constructing it. Okay, okay. Jeez, and crow. So many things, so many things to do. Oh, I don't know what to do. Uh, 
Okay, and then we need the welding torch. And we need the iron sheets. All right, now we need the cables. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. Seriously? Come on. Oh. All right, versatility is a virtue. Need ingots in a hurry? Fabrication devices also provide resource storage. Uh, eject them from the auto lathe by pulling the lever, then add them to another machine. All right, active vents are critical aerodynamic components. You can now fabricate one with a hydraulic pipe bender. Uh, okay, so now we select active vent on pipe bender. Uh, fabricate active vent. Turn off pipe bender. And pick up. Okay. Good work, cadet. You've created and completed a fabrication system. That's the last step of practical testing phase three. Uh, press the complete button. Uh, to transmit your results to station here command. God dang it. Jeez, I'm crow. Uh, I'm dreading when they're gonna tell us to, uh, to repair a building. Oh, congratulations, your results have been received by Stationary Command of the Off-World Development Agency. Time for airlocks the next tutorial. Yeesh. <sighs> airlocks, welcome to that. You complete this phase of testing and pressurize your base. You will run you through. We will run you through basic airlock construction. Suit's uh, before we start, looks like your suit's taking some damage. 
Use duct tape to fix it. Oh, yeah, well, you know what they say. You can't duck it. What heck with it. Repair suit. How do you repair suit? It's just okay, so you just right click and it does it. Okay. Hmm. I wasn't paying attention to the video. Ah, uh, let's get started to build an airlock. Start by printing two doors. You will need to add ingots from the crate to the auto lathe. You can now print two door two door kits using the multi axis modular uh, compositional system, aka the auto lathe. Uh, and begin isolating yourself from the loneliness and disappointment of space. So, print two door kits. So we turn on to here. Two door kits. Two door kits. And kits. Door. Oops. Bingo. I did. Now, uh, before you can uh, construct replacement doors, ODA protocol dictates you must remove the destroyed ones. Well, I mean, technically, yes. So, evidently, I just made two walls, two crates. That's awesome. Where's the... Good work. Now build uh, composite doors in the highlighted positions. You'll need to cycle through the options to get the correct door variant.
Oh, are you kidding me? Jeez, I'm crow. Okay, that's it. I need... I need to put that there. Construct. Did I not? do it what is going on Four way connector. Oh. I think. Huh. At the station here, you need to finish things. Complete construction of the doors using resources from the crate. Uh, and your bill, your inbuilt sub sentient AI tooltip HUD helper. Sure. Finish construction of door one, finish construction of door two. What am I missing? 
Scheiße. Missing. Oh, I need some kind of circuit board. I lost myself. Okay.
Mm. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. Okay. That's where this comes into play. <laughs> okay, now. Area control, power control. Technically, we just know what we want. What we want is. Atmospherics. We want to we want air conditioning, no. Atmospheric devices. Hmm. I hate the fact I gotta hold down this left alt just to It's not it either. Construction kits? No. Door. No. Guides. Holy crap. Um, no, 
my structures cartridges. Search door door control no. Crap. <laughs> uh, is there a way to recycle these? <laughs> Dang it. I used all the gold. I used all the copper. Dang it. Cur <laughs> Exit. I don't want to save. Oh, I can't believe I just did all that. I didn't turn it off. Okay, okay, okay. I got this, I got this. Alright, this is that. Okay. Okay. All right, now I know to shut off so that you don't end up freaking using up all your resources.
I just did that wrong. No, I did it right. I hope. I got the wrong doors in here. 